Today's topic is going to be a little bit of a different conversation, different flavor as it involves a little bit of an astrology mixed with psychology. Today we're going to be talking about Mars in Scorpio. The exploration is going to be psychological in nature. Just to put that out as a premise because there are so many modalities and tangents that Mars and Scorpio discussion can flow into Mars in Scorpio. As soon as we start to explore a Mars in Scorpio, the mind goes into a fuzz. The mind becomes intrigued. The mind becomes ready for a roller coaster ride into the depths of the unknown. So for the context of this discussion, we're going to make Mars the subject of this conversation. As if Mars is a person, a human that is exploring the land of Scorpio, the zodiac sign of Scorpio. So once this premise is set into perspective, we can move forward into the exploration of what Mars as an embodied perspective feel and move through the sign of Scorpio. It's intriguing, it's intense, it's curious, curious, it's ready, it's prepared. Mars in Scorpio is a placement that, that invokes respect, that invokes a sturdiness in character. Mars in Scorpio is dynamic, it's versatile, it can move and quickly become something else. It's an ambiguity in its relaxed form. Mars in Scorpio is ambiguous, which is total lack of any coherence, right? It's ambiguous. It, it's something that doesn't make sense intellectually. That's the key to understanding Mars in Scorpio nature because it's not intellectual. A Mars in Scorpio is highly, highly feeling, sensing, being. It is not a thinking being. And so what that means is that life itself becomes an exploration of the depth that it contains. Moving through life, every aspect of it is a vortex into a certain depth that can or cannot be explored. That's the kind of quality that a Mars in Scorpio has, which is unseen and unheard of in any other placement. The need, the desire to go deeper, 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 and deeper. To explore the depth. Mars in Scorpio likes to feel ambiguous because it's in that state of ambiguity that true substance for transformation is found pure, pure substances can be found in the depths of explorations that drives a Mars in Scorpio. Mars is the planet of action. Mars is the planet that is our energetic body. How we spend our energies, how we choose to indulge in certain activities that spend our energy. For example, working out, sports, anything that involves physical vitality is ruled by Mars. When Mars is in the sign of Scorpio, energy investment is a big word, it's a key word, because energy is a reserve, energy is currency, currency for a Mars in Scorpio. Any direction in which I then choose to focus my energy is an investment to a Mars in Scorpio. What are investments? Investments are something that you give a part of yourself to in the hopes that it's going to bring a return. That's investment. Anything, any activity is a choice of investment for a Mars in Scorpio. That's how deep it is. Any simple activity could be life-changingly important in the psyche of a Mars in Scorpio because 
for them they're say they are able to see the interdimensionality of taking an action and how that interplays and keeps on interplaying in the matrix of existence. They can see that if I choose to invest my energy in this person, in this business, in this relationship, then this is how it's going to unfurl. And so for a lot, a lot of times, a Mars and Scorpio will prohibit themselves completely from doing something because they can understand the ripple effect of an action and how nuanced it is, how intricate any action that we take is in the interplaying of matrix of existence. It's very integral energetic investments because they tend to educate us, they tend to align us with that what we truly are and so examining our energetic investments is one of the key areas for a Mars and Scorpio to align with the desires, to align with with the internal sense of where they where they're going and where they want to be. A Mars and Scorpio is passionate. Passion comes from this need for exploration. The thirst is insurmountable. The thirst is insatiable. The thirst is the passion. It's almost like anything that we find challenging or so desire then becomes a part of our lives. Even if we don't have it in, in our hands materialistically, it doesn't matter. Let me explain this. This is very interesting how it happens. So for me and my psyche, once something is set in stone internally for me, then there's pretty much nothing in this world that can shake the conviction of a Mars and Scorpio. Period. That's it. It's sealed. It's done. A Mars and Scorpio doesn't know how to budge. It's not how we work. A Mars and Scorpio does not know how to stop once there is a goal set in mind in the psyche. You see, everything is internal for this placement everything. Everything is psyche oriented. Everything is driven from the inside into the outside. There's nothing in the outside that can change or cause a transformation that is internal and intense in nature. It has to come from inside, inside the depths of our own psyche, of our own being, of our own heart. And when that happens, passion awakens. And when passion awakens, it, it's a very short road from passion to obsession for a Mars in Scorpio. It's almost the same, I would say. Passion becomes obsession very quickly. Sometimes there's no boundaries. And until and unless that passion is closely, intimately, deeply, wildly, experienced into the depths of the being of a Mars and Scorpio. Till then, there's no way that they're going to stop obsessing about it. There's no way that we're going to stop being passionate about something. It's not how it works. And so passion is, is a companion for life. If there is no passion involved, then energetic investments are futile at the best. If there is no passion, then a Mars and Scorpio would much rather not do or invest in something. So there's a connection. There's always a connection. A Mars and Scorpio, because of this need to understand the depths of existence, they have this curiosity for human existence, to understand the nuances of human existence. More often than not, you'd find a Mars in Scorpio wanting to invest in the understanding or educating themselves about psychology, about astrology, about the occult, about tarot, tarot cards. Anything that can invigorate their psyche to feel and understand something that they've been looking to understand and feel, they're gonna go right into it. Astrology, psychology, occult, tarot card, yoga, the yogic lifestyle, Buddhism, and the multifarious 
tools and modes of human psychic exploration that we can find a Mars and Scorpio would almost certainly definitely explore and dive deep into it. A Mars and Scorpio is a power, is a force. A Mars and Scorpio was always heavily dependent upon inner work. They'll always be exploring, transforming, traversing through some kind of inner work. So inner work is so important for Mars and Scorpio. They will literally drag their entire being down to the depths of hell if that is required for the work. <sighs> Mars and Scorpio knows no bounds. There is no restriction when it comes to going after something. There is no boundaries, there is no restrictions. Restrictions are human-made, psyche-made, and they know how to bend it. They know how to bend the rules and the laws of existence. They know how to create magic in the moment, right here, right now. They know how to pierce you, pierce you in not just one way, but with their entire being. A Mars and Scorpio carries themselves with with a power that is untouched and unseen. If you are a Mars and Scorpio and or have people, loved ones, friends who have this placement and are around you, then please understand that this is one of the most beautiful opportunities for you to explore something that otherwise life doesn't present as often as it should. It's a hidden gem if you have a Mars and Scorpio in your life. Ask them questions that you've been pondering your entire life and haven't found the answers to. Ask them anything that your heart so desires. Spend time with them. Breathe with them. Meditate with them. Observe how they are in their personal space. Mars and Scorpio has a lot to offer in terms of understanding how we work, how to intensify the inner work, how to not be scared of life, of intensity, of feelings, of depth, how to be brave in the face of atrocities, how to be brave in the face of immense and intense struggles, how to be brave in the face of intense pain. A Mars in Scorpio teaches us that. It's a beautiful placement and I am looking forward so much to explore more about it with you. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you soon in another video.